Witness the story that takes place all throughout time. See each of our chosen heroes and the evil that threatens their peace. Welcome to Live Alive. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to The Void. Yes. I'm Player One. I'm Player Two and I'm eating a strawberry minto. Very cool. And welcome back to Live Alive. So last time, um, there's been a death. Poor Kirk. Don't know what happened. Apparently his life support failed. Everyone's taking it well. Right? No. I would... Where's Rachel? Oh. Uh, hmm. All right, well, sir, um... Are we, gonna need, are we gonna be able to finish this game? No, not yet. Later. Okay. Oh, okay. Fuck two boys. Oh. I don't know what to do. Think, think. Where is the captain? I don't know. It's gotten into the captain lately. He's always cared for the crew, does not best to keep us out of harm's way, he prided himself on it. Although operations don't value the human element, but we do, which ironically goes against our baser instincts, he told me once. Well, so what's the one other thing we can do at the moment? Coffee. Coffee. Thank you, but I don't need one right now. I've no need of a drink. Perhaps your dejected looking comrade would appreciate the gesture. Huey? I don't know what to do. Alfie. Thank you. Trapezoid. I think we found this this game's bit. We're gonna name mm -hmm. the names of these characters are gonna be very similar to their default, but just slightly off. Ooh. Right. Get yourself together. Sir, are you still in your quarters? Well, anyway, there's been an accident. And Kirk? I'm afraid Kirk is dead. What? Really? That's... That's most unfortunate. This situation merits an appropriate response. He will be dearly missed. See to the preparations. I will make sure to attend. Wait, Captain! Hmm. Your Captain is a man of remarkable composure. He remains calm and collected, even after being told one of his crew has died tragically. Seems I have work to attend to at the airlock. Uh oh. Uh oh. I suppose I could go and look around in Kirk's quarters. See if he had any prized possessions. Something to put in the casket. <laughs> Damn. Uh, that's thoughtful of you. By all means, please.
So, we should follow Father. Should we follow Father? Yes. Yes. I can't, I can't yes. watch a mirror lock. No, not yet. Why not? Because trust me, sir. We want to go to Kirk's room. Uh, I believe one more down, one more hallway down. Captain Whore. Oh, lovely. Ah, uh, yes, just like your mother. And there it is. I'm sorry. All right, top left. I had two. Did you? Yes, it is a sickness. Kirk Wells has regrettably passed away. To facilitate the collection and disposal of his personal effects, access restrictions have been lifted. However, regulations stipulate that a record of all entrants must be maintained. And we put in the name. Burial in space, huh? There is comfort, at least, in having the opportunity to mourn. Bother. Wait, no, I, I wanted to look at the bed. What do we have here? A book? The warp drive. Science fiction or reality? Ah, this would explain a lot. Like that expression he was so fond of when time was short. Warp speed, as of saying it, made it possible, made it real. We should leave this here. Rachel would be most upset if anyone else touched it. So now talk to his thingy. Memory phone. Talk to his thingy. I wish you could jump in this game, so... That was where I could just jump on the bed. Of a dead man? Sir. What's the password? What's the password? Trapezoid? No. What is it? We were just oh, told warp. it. Warp, uh, warp speed. Warp speed. Oh. Sands. Oh, oh. <laughs> Speeded? Warp speed. Do I put the exclamation? Let's try it without first. Note, note to self. Stash it at the foot of the bed. Now you can check the bed. Foot of the bed. Memory card obtained. Now we can beat Captain Square. This item can be used to save your progress in the Captain Square video game. And there you are. Nice. Now what do we do? Now we can go to the airlock to continue on. Do we want to do Captain Square first? Oh, uh, well, we can really do it at any time at this point could even let's do, technically let's do, do it, it. We, could, we could technically do it after we beat this chapter all right let's do that then yeah because i'll be honest you don't get anything from it it's just a thing to do airlock's in level three right uh level one So yeah, I'm gonna fight you. The memory card, only like optional 
item thing you can get in this chapter. This chapter is very tiny, very linear, not much to it. Just tells a good story. Hello, Huey. Hello, Huey Dubois. How did it come to this? Pause. I never liked the man. Far from it. But never, not even once, did I wish he was dead. Never. Oh. Damn. And yeah, that's all we came in here for, so uh, now we leave. And next, we want to uh, sick bay. With the body? Yes. All right, which floor is sick bay? Second. I wish to gaze upon the beast. You want to make sure it's it's there. Yeah. What if it wasn't? What if it wasn't here? I'd be very concerned. No, it's still here, but now it's looking at you. Ah. Uh... Dad, I'm scared. Yep. Uh, so yeah, uh, sick bay. Dad. Dad, the beast knows me by name. <laughs> Dad. Dad, I want to go home. So yeah, I also, I underestimated how much was in here. Yeah, I don't think we're going to finish this. Well, we're still going to make good progress, though. So yeah, we just had to sick bay for no reason, and, um... Where's the body? Oh, shit. We need, we need to go tell someone. Uh, father? Father, the body's gone. That dad. Dad, there ain't no body in there. Come again? The body's missing? And then we go back. Father, I hope I'm scared. Where did the body go? Mm hmm. It was better the behemoth. Or maybe it got up by itself. But he's not dead. I'm just throwing out theories. What the hell is going on here? I'd like to know as much as you would. Wait, where is Rachel? Did no one contact her? Why isn't she here? Uh. And I think... We now go to her room. Oh. What? <laughs> Sir, do you see what's going on here? She... Yes, but I don't understand it. She doesn't have a cadaver in her bed. Mm. Kurt, my love. <laughs> Still catching up on sleep, are we? 
Oh. Oh, she's she's going cuckoo. She's gone, gone. That's fine. I'll have some fresh baked cookies ready for you soon. Mmm. That ought to get you out of bed. <laughs> uh. Rachel. Rachel. Rachel, you are weird. Rachel, Rachel, what is this? <laughs> it's not good, is what it is. Oh. Don't, don't you dare try to take him from me again. Oh. Oh. Oh, Huey. Clever little Huey. If he was out of the picture, then it'd all go back to the way it was. I come running back and leap into your arms. That's what you thought, isn't it? That's why you tried to kill him, isn't it? Okay, we're making a please. lot of assumptions here. Okay. Yeah, that's Just go. Guys, my, your, your legs are, should be getting tired now from all the conclusions you're jumping to. Calm Listen down to here. Get out of there, Rachel, before Huey tries to stop you. I'm waiting for you outside the airlock. Don't worry about my body. Hurry. Warp speed. Um... <gasps> outside the airlock, huh? Rachel, stop! Jesus. Bro, bro. Jesus. Yeah, now shit's definitely hitting the fan. Uh, airlock. That is level level one. Uh, what I'm the hell? As fast as I what the hell was that? Don't worry this about looks that. Looks like we'll be able to hide in it. Yeah, don't worry about that just yet. That comes later. <laughs> Father, why did you not make me faster? I'm on skates, but I walk the same speed. Father, why do I not have jelly propulsion? I wish to go shoom. Father, I wish to go new. I have the zoomies, but not the speed at which to reach him. Rachel, this is insane! Get your hands off me! Lady, lady, calm down here. Yeah, so, uh, actually, uh, nothing we can do. We have to leave. Oh, whore bishop. Yeah, we just we came in. We could go out. Technically, we could go out, but, uh, how would we get back? Um... Father gave the beast. Um, the beast awakens. And now we get into the thick of it. Also, uh... Father... Father, help! Also, you, uh... You wanna start saving now. Yeah, you want to... You want to start... Saving. When we get to different rooms. Why? 
Io sì. You wanna go down. What happened in this place? You want to run. If it touches you, uh, game over. Actually. Evading the behemoth. Uh, yeah. And now, it can pop up in the ship. Just whenever. Oh, yeah. So we have to deal with that now. How did he get loose? God damn it. Uh, hey, 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 guys. Hey, guys, we got a we got a we got a problem here. Um, get, get, guys. What do you mean the behemoth is loose? Oh, shit. Damn it! You crazy bitch! Ah, ah, ah. Father, father, father. Oh! Father, help! You're right. No. Oh, thank goodness. She really I damage as far as I can see. She really just went for it. Okay. Now look me in the eyes and listen very carefully to what I have to say. We were all there in the med bay. We all saw Kirk. We all saw him on that bed and saw the system pronounce him dead. Okay? You remember that, don't you? I know it's hard to accept, but he's gone. No matter how much you may want to believe otherwise, that's the truth. You can take it from here, I trust. I need to check the cargo hold. That man's gonna die. Big boy. Thank you. Well, he did, he did subdue her, so. <laughs> We've had enough death for one day. He's not a bad guy. He's just a little robotist. Oh. Darth here. The clank was right. The container is empty. And to make matters worse, the specimen appears to have escaped the cargo hold. Mm -hmm. There's no telling where it's got to. Keep your eyes peeled and be prepared to run. Mm -hmm. Let's regroup at the elevator near you and head to the upper levels. Again, can someone turn that game off? I'm sorry. I suppose I... I couldn't accept it. It's just... It was all so sudden. One minute he was here, and then...
imagine if the behemoth could appear in this room. Yeah, that would suck. Well, time to do the one thing we know how to do. I, I know your boyfriend is dead, and you tried to kill me, but, um, how feel? Yeah, you having fun there? Uh, just making sure sure the milk is swirled correctly. I, I think it's still black. Shh. I'm, I'm sorry. Trying. I suppose I, I yeah, you you've you've just said this. <laughs> oh, thank you. You've always been so kind to me. I have no more motions. I've been alive for approximately hello, two hours. Hello, hello. Well, I hope. Uh, Captain. You are aware that a behemoth is currently prowling your decks, aren't you? What? Really? That's uh, that's most unfortunate. Hmm. Are you joking? It's a bloody catastrophe is what it is. How long do you intend to keep huddling in your quarters instead of coming out and taking charge of this situation? What? Really? It's a recording. That's... that's uh, most unfortunate. What? Really? That's... That's what? most unfortunate. Really? The behemoth's still out there. And so is Kirk. I can't let that thing hurt him. Girl. Rachel! Ma the man is dead. Oh, good heavens. No, no, you don't. Or are you that eager to die? But Rachel and Huey, they... Wait. Send us father. So just wait for a few seconds. Just wait a little bit. I'm sorry. But I can't just abandon them. Go, father. All right, now that we're going back out into uh, dangerous territory, just gonna go ahead and do that. All right. So, yeah. We want to oh, go down. There's scratch oh. marks. Oh. Oh. Oh, they're dead. Huey. Rachel. Is Rachel... No. No, she's not. She's all right. You don't need to worry about her. <sighs> what were you thinking? Running after her like that. And now, this. It's okay, Gato. It's okay. No, it's I, not. I didn't really have a choice. I think, even now, after everything, I, I love... Rachel's still alive. We need to move quickly. And we were down to four. Yes, of course. We should take her back to the pods. Put her in cryo for now. She'll be safe there. Is he unconscious? Little one? No. I 
have a... I need you to head to the interface room right away and speak with Decimus. We need emergency access to the captain's quarters. I realize I'm asking you to put yourself at even greater risk in what is already a terrible... But there is no one else, little one. Only you. Everything will be all right. I have... We'll get through this and make it back home together. Well... Do you think our father is married? Hmm. Right. Let's move. Probably not. Father, I wish for siblings. And a mother who's not your fatter wrench. Alright, well, gotta go say hello to the Go 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 Ah oh, shit. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry you fumbled. Alas, Trapezoid never had the opportunity to set foot on Earth. <laughs> yup. Wait. Uh. Autosave. Oh. Oh, 20 save slots. How'd you do that? I didn't do that. All right, so go in the door. Straight to the door. Hello, big bitch. You, uh, you didn't go in the door. Sir. S -s 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 Sir. <laughs> I'm trying. You. You 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 pressed the the thingy. Okay, one more try. Maybe we should approach it from a different angle. No, that's just that's the quickest way. Let me, let me, let me, let me. I can slow you down immensely. You will kill us both. In the door! Why doth he approach like that? Because he wants our giblets, mechanical giblets. Request received for emergency access code for the captain's quarters. Processing. Processing. Request approved. Generating override code. Oak, F-D-E. Remember that. Oak, F-D-E? Oak, F-D-E. Oak, F-D-E. Let's go ahead and drop another quick save right here. Can't be a two. Can't be a two, you know. Safe. All right, so now, So now. So now. Uh, let's follow the follow the flag. Oh shit! He's here! He's here! Go! 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 Top door! Top door! All right, Thank Prime. heavens, you're okay. Yes. This should suffice. Enough talk. It's time we put an end to the charade. Charade? Wow. Corporal, you don't really think... I know the captain's been behaving strangely, but to hurt his own people... It's just that... It beggars belief. Then who do you think is responsible? Me? No, no, of course not. Regardless, your captain has a lot to answer for. Really, at this point, 
Who could it be? Mukuro Ikusaba? Junko? Here goes nothing. We don't have time for this. Just force the bloody thing open. You think he can do it? Don't worry. I came prepared. I thought it might come to this. Ah, here, little one. Hold on to this for me. So, we done got an item. The powered pry bar. Ooh. And there is its uh, um, battery right there. It can be used to force open doors. Sealed doors and hatches may be forced open with the powered pry bar. However, be warned that it may be used a limited number of times. So don't just use it on any door. Use it on ones we need to open. Is there a place to recharge it? I don't know. I don't believe so. All right, Captain's oh, room. Let's see. Here. Once it's done, we're, we're oh. dead. Captain! I thought so. The only ones still up and moving on this ship are you and me. No more games, Kato. What in blazes are you on about? How long do you intend to play the fool? You killed him. This is all you're doing. Ah. Uh. That's ridiculous. For all I know, it could have been you. Me? I'm just a passenger. I have no connections to you people, no motive. But in my short time here, I've seen the tension, smelled the bad blood. I don't know what drove you to it, but I'm not surprised. It wasn't me, damn it! It wasn't me! Just shut up! You don't know me! You don't know anything about us! We didn't always get along, I'll admit. I'd be hard-pressed to call us friends, even. I doubt I would have exchanged two words with Kirk or Rachel if we'd met anywhere else. They're just... We're just too different. But even so, I didn't hate them. And they didn't hate me. I know that much. None of us. Not me, or the Captain, or Huey. We're not murderers. We're... we're all just... stuck in our heads. Too caught up in our own worries to notice when others are hurting. Unable to see beyond our own wants and wounds. Beyond the life we wish we had and think we deserve. We're just people. Damn. Yeah. That was beautiful, Father. Just there. All right. Well, sir, we're now down to three. Three of us are up and running, and we've got a monster on the loose. Is it, uh, is it, is it good? Is that, uh, is, that, is that a good situation to be in? No, obviously not. So yeah, I think we'll uh, I think we'll end it there. Definitely one more part will be done because we're now in in the big shit now in the in the huge ginumdus poo poo. <laughs> Indeed. So, oh, I can also check here now. Yeah, we have the we have these two. Uh, so yeah, we'll end it there. I've been player one. I haven't played it too.
and we'll see you next time when we finish the distant future. Bye bye. Bye bye.